Welcome back to more Resident Evil 2. Quit holding my hand, kid, you bother me. And we're gonna ride the Sky Tram, it's gonna be awesome. Huh. Oh, me damn, nothing bad happened. This you find by using the little lighter thing on this, because it fires a flare. It doesn't really matter because it doesn't do much for Claire. It's mainly for Leon. I mean, it's still nice for Claire to have, but it's not essential. Well, I guess it's not essential for Leon either, but <laughs> not real bright if you skip it, because you have the lighter with him. Some just random t shirt and jeans guy get down here. I like how she moves to get behind me. That's kind of clever, actually. Still a metric ton of ammo. One more bad guy. He has this thing, which is kind of useless. But why the hell not? Are you, are you coming with me? Okay, cool. Because I will tase you. You little turd. I don't know what this is designed to be good against, but it's... Eh, it's just not. Hey, free ammo never hurt anybody. So this guy right here. Ammo not lasting nearly as long. Huh. Much better than I remember it being. Maybe it's because I'm playing the DualShock version this time. Come full up. I'm dead, I'll give it that. It's a reward for skipping the uh, submachine gun. I say now we should be here. Okay, we don't need the valve anymore. Come up here. We need this. Tempted. Probably a stupid idea, though. Four flame rounds. There we go. I'll give it a shot. Why the hell not? 
Okay, free grenades! <coughs> Lots of fire grenades. I wonder if we should use them on something in the near future. And a save point, which is always good. I will not be taking advantage of it, but I will be making a save. Yay, computers. Yes. Okay, that's not bad. Let us continue on and hope for the best. I actually tried using the spark shot on this guy. Sounds like a bad Mega Man weapon. <coughs> High voltage gun to repel experimental animals. It uses spark shot rounds and has a range of 10 feet. It seemed a lot longer than that. Well, I think. Here's a map for that place you've already been through. You lucky devil, you. God damn it, Sherry. flame rounds in here. Why they're in the bathroom? I don't know. I got a spark shot doesn't work, I'm ready though. Yeah, there's a boss battle coming up. Because why not? <clears throat> Sherry finally gets enough energy to get down the ladder and it's like, I gotta climb up that son of a bitch again? Halloween candy. Hang in there, Sherry. Your forehead's burning up. I've got to hurry before the embryos pupate. The what? <laughs> yeah, just say stuff like that in front of the kid. <laughs> Walking dead. You told Clem she had embryos inside her. Red light will turn on and access from outside will be prohibited for a limited time. Okay, so once we leave, we can't come back in. We'll be trapped. You bastard. Got a new head. New fingers. Further away. Okay, now it's time to kill. How much damage is it? Enough, apparently. We're already on, uh... Squishy. Aim at him. Oh, cool. Yeah, spark shot did pretty good. Huh, I'm impressed. Didn't even have the decent to drop any... Bastard.
Sherry. Uh, uh, Finally awake. Isn't this... That's okay. You keep it. I'm sure it'll keep you safe. Thank you, Claire. Even though I'm an only child, neither of my parents ever spent much time with me because of their work. I grew up alone. But now that you're with me, I finally have someone to rely upon. Aww. Please, I'd really like to be alone now. Rest here for a bit. I'll be right back. As soon as I found the antidote for you. More flame rounds. Where's the box at? There we go. for it now. I don't know where I was missing it in the police station, but... Um... Yeah, I'm just gonna go with this. <laughs> yeah, this works for me. Oh yeah, you have to re-equip a weapon because you took your gun off to carry Sherry around. Now we're in Umbrella's secret laboratory. Underneath Raccoon's feet. And it's way down there, too. There's a map of it in one of the games. Okay, we need to get power back on, which I think is blue. I want a strategy simulation game where you run an umbrella-type laboratory and commit atrocities against nature. Wouldn't that be awesome? Sure, switch. Door spots. No power. With a car key in response. I don't know, I just think that'd be cool as hell. Have to keep your experiments in line and keep the media from finding out too much, or protect your employees, and just the life insurance premiums alone would be ridiculous. Uh, we need this thing. And then I don't think there's anything else in here. Oh, computer for organizing data files. Fascinating. Damn it, Claire. Cold fusion. Huzzah! Yes, I saw the first aid speed, just not taking it. I've got two I haven't even used. I don't think the shutter's anything important. So. so cool! It's like a transformer. It is a transformer, just in a pun kind of way.
Oh, son of a bitch. I don't have a lighter, do I? <sighs> Sigh. User restoration. Guest, no password, valid for 24 hours for the culture experimentation room. I think it's just hit points. Laboratory security manual. Security measures in case of emergency. In the instance of an uncontrollable biohazardous outbreak, all security measures will be directed toward the underground transport facility. In the instances of any abnormalities are detected among cargo transit, all materials will automatically be transported from the loading zone to the designated high-speed train, at which point all materials will be isolated and disposed of. And in the instance of a Class 1 emergency, the entire train will be purged. Ooh. In the instance the lab itself becomes contaminated, the northern route most currently used to transport materials from the facility will be designated emergency escape route. Da -da -da -da. Okay. I thought it would explain what to do with this. The anti-BOW gas sprinkler. Let me turn on the switch. I think it makes my playthrough easier, but then it'll make Leon's harder. So we won't worry about it. Hey, more bow gun bolts. Maybe we should get that out. I kinda wanna see what the sparker does to a liquor though. Let's go get the lighter. Jesus. Is there not enough backtracking? We need more. Oh, Jesus, where'd you come from? Oh, God. Killed enough stuff with the sparker. Let's grab the bow gun then. You know, for the lulls. Yeah, sparker's running low on juice. Goddamn lighter again. <sighs> The nice thing about the bow gun is it reloads really quick. That does fairly good damage to zombies. I'm not sure what it does to liquors. I don't know if I've ever used it on one. But we've got flame rounds for them. And there are no horrible fly monkeys in this one like there are in 1 and 3. Damn the fly monkeys. stuff, so you don't want that to happen. Oh, screw you guys. God damn liquors. Okay, so the bogan is horrible against liquors. Good to know. Good to know. What am I doing in here? Interior has been destroyed by the plant. Excellent. Hey, grenades. Oh, I suppose I might as well. I 
don't really need two grenades that badly. Eh, whatever. If you do, there they are. You just have to kill two advanced clickers. Wait, no, I want to. First, we have to do this. So there's blab zombies! Good times. I don't want to put up with plant zombie crap. I think they come back to life if you don't kill them with fire. One might be enough, but they take a while to die, so I usually end up pumping another round into them for GPs. And yeah, big creepy, uh, yeah, tentacle plant. That's great. That's, that's what I wanted to walk into. Another one. Wow, a bunch of those. Don't mind if I do. worry about yet. Okay, now we should have a safe room. Yes, safe room. I mean, as safe as you can get. Look at the monitors. Look at the monitors. Oh, map of the lab. Yeah, sure. Why not? Okay, uh, I'm gonna stop here for just a second and render footage, and we'll be right back. Until then.